Hi, I'm Jared Norton with Unified Fire Authority, here to talk today about proper use and disposal of fireworks. We have an assortment of different fireworks. We've got the large cakes or aerials, and we have the smaller um, aerials as well as fountains and the little noisemakers. For kids, we want to cover these little small items that generally are packaged more for uh, them. Uh, we want to rem remember that even though they are uh, look like toys, they are not toys. Make sure that even things like sparklers, sparklers burn at 1200 plus degrees Fahrenheit. We're giving our kids a glowing hot wire. If they've been out playing in the sun all day, they're in shorts, flip-flops, barefoot, it's a good idea to get long pants on them and some shoes, closed-toed shoes, when they actually start using the fireworks. Uh, we want to uh, also make sure, even though some of these fountains are smaller, we need to still stay back. Um, these aren't ones where we want to let the kids get up close, even though the packaging is smaller, they still can burn. We have aerials here. We have the smaller aerials that are new to Utah. We want to make sure that these aerial devices, fireworks, are being lit off in areas where, first, that they are legal uh, with your jurisdiction or municipality. So you can look up um, your city's website or unifiedfire.org. We have a map, uh, interactive map, that you can put in your address and see where you live um, and if the fireworks are, are indeed legal for that time of year. For actual lighting these off, there's a few considerations we want to, to think about. One is, what's above us? Tree cover, do we have brush, dry brush, anywhere close to us? We want to make sure we're not actually going to be using these um, at that point because of the, the potential fire hazard. Before you go to light them, though, we have a couple of bricks. These bricks allow us to stabilize the aerial or the cake um, so that it is going to stay in place and not bounce around and end up tipping over. So, set your bricks in place. Make sure you've read the warnings and all instructions with that. Light the fuse. Back away. Make sure your family and friends and everybody with you are, are in a safe location. Some of these cakes require you to take off the top wrapper. So make sure, again, read the instructions for the firework prior to um, setting it up and, and lighting it. We have larger cakes or the larger aerials. Some of these can travel up to 150 feet in the air. So wind is a very significant factor or potential fire hazard. I have a couple larger bricks, center blocks, that can hold these larger cakes in place and make sure they don't bounce around on you. Disposing of your fireworks. There are three things to have handy. One, a bucket of water, an extinguisher, and a garden hose. The bucket of water can be used for your smaller aerials, sparklers, and other small fountains that will fit inside the bucket. Make sure that the fireworks are completely submerged and soaked prior to, to disposing them in a garbage can. To the extinguisher is a great tool to have close by should a small fire start. For the larger arrows and cakes that won't fit in your bucket, the garden hose. Soak them down, make sure that they are good and drenched prior to disposing of the firework itself. One thing to consider on the, the aerials is to count however many shots they are, that you get that many. If you don't and it stops, stay back from the firework for a matter of time, allow it to cool off a little. You never want to approach it thinking, oh, it's all done, but then ends up one is, has a slow delay and, and fires um, with you in proximity. So count, but also give it some time before you approach uh, to remove the firework or hose it down. One thing to remember is that modifying or um, tampering with fireworks is unsafe as well as illegal. So always read the instructions on the side of the firework. Have close adult supervision 
and never modify or tamper with your fireworks. Please enjoy the holiday. Remember that fireworks can be an enjoyable time for us. Use them safe and responsibly. If anything should happen, we are here. Call 911 as soon as you can. Rose, and bright stars.